Hey, so I played through Life is Strange recently. I, I played through it twice, actually. I'm not going to talk about the game, like, critically or anything Glad like that, because I want this friendly. video to be spoiler-free, but I took some screenshots while I was playing the game, and I think it would be entertaining to have a commentary over them. If you aren't familiar with the game, it's primarily story-based, so you're not going to get a ton of unique screen grabs. I was just taking screenshots when I stumbled across something and felt the need to save it and uh, was fast enough to hit my screenshot shortcut before the opportunity went away. But uh, looking back on what little I got, I ended up with an interesting variety of content. Uh, that intro was too long. Um, this is the first image I'm going to show. Uh, this is in a PowerPoint presentation, I shouldn't say that. I definitely screen capped this because of that old Overwatch meme. I, I think I can label this as a good picture to send to my friends with no context, and that makes me happy. Old fishermen never die. Sorry, this this was a bad a bad start. But let, let's move on. Um, I I think I took this image right after the last one. Actually, Max uh, isn't saying this line as it may appear. The fisherman is. Um, where is he? Oh, there, there he is. Okay. Sorry for the normie meme, but um. This is me after uh, saying hi to someone outside of my house. Um, okay, you're probably going to wonder why I screen capped this, but I, th I think this text is um, hobo standard. Hobo standard being the, um, the font I use most of the time I use text in my videos. Well, let me check real quick. Uh, yeah, yeah, it actually is. Wow. <laughs> that's, that's the only reason I screen capped this. Um, if you haven't heard of the band oh, Zebrahead, you're gonna be real out of the loop for a little bit here. Uh, sorry. If you're not gonna get these references, just skip to this point in the video. I apologize, but it's just the kind of thing that I hope, uh, once I get an audience, everyone will kind of get these jokes, because I make them a lot, but... Anyway! Um, see that C? Uh, grab that plank. This is the junkyard where there's an old ship that you put a plank on. And uh, here's Max uh, walking the plank and hoping it's better down under the sea. But, but honestly, who brings a knife to a gunfight? I was really hoping to get a screenshot to reference every song on Walk the Plank. So um, there's this one time Jefferson tells a student to keep it to herself. Myself, keep it to myself. Uh, we're gonna move on. I'm sorry. I that was yeah. We're gonna. Move on. Uh, I I got demonetized the last time I referenced "Save Your Breath" and um, used used that word. So um, I'm not gonna risk showing that word. Um. Honestly, I already captioned my screenshots on Steam pretty well, um, but I don't get any interaction with them there, which is uh, why I'm making this video. There's no joke here, I just like this image. It's honestly too bad I didn't take more screenshots like this um, to, to glorify the just the art in the game. The game is very visually appealing, and... I do have to run my game on relatively low graphic settings, so um, I didn't really feel like I could give the art style any real justice. Okay, I honestly wasn't even going to include this. It was just a lazy attempt to reference back to a Zebrahead song. I just uh, noticed something about it that I didn't notice before. Um, I'll let you figure it out. Uh, silhouette aesthetic. This the, the the game's camera like has this perspective between first and third person that really gives you great opportunities to take cool screenshots like this. If you have a better computer than me, um, make a video like this just dedicated to to cool cool stuff like this. I had the game glitch out on me a couple times and I couldn't rewind anymore. Um. Max's powers sure are uh, mysterious. 
Okay, the next stuff I show might be considered spoilers by some people. I don't really think so because there's nothing about the plot revealed. Just really obscured, out of context stuff. But if you're super sensitive about spoilers, I suppose you could get upset if I didn't warn you right now. But let's move on. I appreciate a variety in my dialogue options. Ooh, this is actually a nice aesthetic. I um, I just screenshot it because I wanted to reference the song. Actually, not by Zebrahead this time. But um, no one gets this reference, but it's a cool image. So, I don't know, go with it, you know? What am I saying? Uh, remember that thing I said about inventing context and uh, how I like doing that? Well, do you? These last two screenshots are actually spoilers, so <laughs> sorry, but there's no avoiding it at this point. Stop watching if you haven't played the game. Uh, this made me laugh a ton when I saw it. There are actually like a bunch of text messages you can read in the um, Fever Dream section, but um, for this one you get a notification like on the screen even if you don't go to the SMS tab. So, um, the first time I played the game was the only one I saw, and it was just, I don't know why, it just, I found it so funny. Like, this just came up, and he was just, like, so casual about guilting Max for letting him die. Like, say hi to my family, and, uh, by the way, you killed me, and I hope you burn in hell. This last image is a perfect metaphor for the supposed choices you have in this game. They tell you that what you choose to say and do is really important. Then you get to the end and every path leads to the same place. I, I do like this game, but I can't say that my second playthrough didn't disappoint me. Like, the whole time whenever I was playing through it, I just kept thinking, oh man, I can't wait to go back through this and, you know, choose, choose the other options and see what happens. But every path ends up leading you to the dark room. But anyway, um, thanks for watching. Nope, if you don't, don't listen to, to Zebrahead and didn't want spoilers, um, you missed most of the content nope, I here. Don't want to go Tell me if you're interested in me making more stuff like this, because I do take screenshots on Steam nope, a lot. I don't want to I'm go not there. sure with a lot of games it would be super interesting, but let me know if you found this entertaining. Ooh, um, before I end this video, I just, uh, I want to give a shout out so to, um, my boy Fedra. I don't know if, um, you know him. He was in some of my videos, um, a few years back. I'm saying this like I have a consistent audience from back then that isn't just my friends who know him. But, um, he, uh, he, uh, got married, um... I'll just use the word recently because I don't know when this video is coming out. But um, if you watch those videos, you probably thought that, you know, I would be the first one to get married. So uh, it's a pretty big surprise there, you know.